It is a big week in the world of sports holidays. Today is American Football Day and tomorrow's National Basketball Day. Who knew? And here in the City of Champions, we know the impact that athletes can make on and off the field. Kiki Brown of Whammo is here for the 3 o'clock drop. And today, we want to know which athlete has served as a great role model, either to you or to the next generation. And it doesn't even have to really impact you. You can see it shining through. Oh, my goodness. There are so many. And being married to, like, a sports guy, he's a yeah. reporter and... I mean, he follows sports like so much. So I'm all constantly hearing these names, uh, not just the athletes of today, but athletes of yesterday. Yeah. I mean, the Flo Joes, the Jesse Owens, the Arthur Ashes. Um, I mean, just so many great Serena Williams. I mean, not and not just African American, but so many that have just pivoted through Absolutely. and continue to rate, sure. uh, clear the pathways for a lot of our young athletes. And I know we're gonna dig into some of these yeah. from some people at home, but mm -hmm. I know like just meeting Cam Hayward, having him on Pittsburgh oh, Today yes, Live before. Awesome. Yeah, I mean, we have the Charlie Batch, like these people yes. who are giving back to the community Huge. after football, during football, like, like they want to keep giving yep. back. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yep. And shout out to Simone. I love that girl so much, Simone I mean, Biles. We need another I friend. Mean, come who on, doesn't? Goat. Yeah. Yes. Seriously. Um, love her. Okay, so let's read uh, one of the first comments we have from Janet, who says, Mario Lemieux. Oh, I come mean, on. His absolutely. perseverance through back come issues on. and cancer, his willingness to give back to the city that adored him, and his extraordinary level of play, even absolutely. when the Penguins were mediocre. All are all harmonics to me. Little bit of shade. Little bit of shade. I love the little hint of shade in this. Well, you're, you're a little mid, but uh, we love you. <laughs> the only thing about him is we can't get an interview. How do you interview Mario I mean, Lemieux? We, we just run into him on the street. Where's I'll he call at? Him. Where's I'll he call at? Him. Yeah, give him I a got, call. I got I'll, I'll text him. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Antoine says Michael Jordan, growing up as a 90s kid, mm -hmm. he was the definition of doing whatever it takes to win in life and being the best that you can be. I also think that there is something about that generation of athletes yeah. Yeah. that was a. Uh, there was no no noise around them. There was no drama. It yeah. was we come, we work, we work for our paycheck, and you know we. Some leave. would look at that as ego. No, but <laughs> no not me. Uh, also, but yeah. Space Jam. Like, come on. Yeah, I mean. Uh, that's what. That's it. Him. That was it. Space Jam for me. That, I mean, come on. Come on. I don't care about would, the rings. Would, I don't care baseball, no, basketball. No, no. Space Body Jam. Endorses Hello. You. Thank space you. Jam. You're done. Come on. Uh, and then we have another Simone Biles. My granddaughter looks up to her because she loves gymnastics. She says yes. she'd like to be her someday. Wouldn't we all? Thing. We were at the Gold Over America tour, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and Lila was almost in tears. She was like, I just want to be her. And I was like, I know we it's, all do. It's the yeah. person, truly. I want to be her size. Yeah. Like, I just want to be a pint, like, just little. She's just want to be that little It's the only way dynamite. that you can do all that. got <laughs> to do it. Cannot do it at this size. No, amen. <laughs> Me neither. Our friend Joey Bag of Donuts, I wasn't old enough to watch him play, but there can't be a bigger role model than Roberto oh, Clemente. Yeah. An amazing oh, player, yeah. an amazing yeah. humanitarian. I love that we get to claim Roberto Clemente yeah. and Pittsburgh. Yeah, Shasta's family doing big things, too. Yeah. Well, that's what I was going to say, yeah. and they are carrying on that His legacy. legacy. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Oh, that's what it that. matters. That's what matters, yep. Uh, Pittsburgh girl Becky, 412 Becky, Becky says, I'd have to say Charlie Batch and Cam Hayward. Oh, I said both of them. You did. Look at that. For Best of the Batch Foundation and the Hayward House and all the work that they do for the, the Pittsburgh it's area. It's about giving back. It really is. You know, that's good. I like that. Especially to the kids. We want to leave the city better than how we found it. That's Absolutely. Right. Uh, Mikey Hood. Big, oh! big fan of my girl. I know her. As her an adult, in. I really oh. love Serena Williams because she was such a fierce competitor. As a kid, I loved Scottie Pippen and Larry Bird, but I haven't no idea why <laughs> because we were told to love them Mikey yeah that's, that's right. true we grew up that's I love true. that yeah Serena yeah. Williams both of them I mean love her oh. and plus she's friends with Beyonce <laughs> Come on, I'm get us in that there. That does enough. Space Jam, Beyonce. Okay, <laughs> um, and I liked this because this was a different take. Um, Pamela Reynolds says athletes that are great in the game but better humanitarians in their real lives. Mm -hmm. Clemente, Franco, Rocky, uh, Mario, they often do so respectfully and put the focus on the cause, not them. Yep. They have quite the generosity. The sport gave them oh. fame and recognition, but the humanitarian activities made them heroes mm -hmm. to look up to. That's what legacy means. Which is what it is. I mean, yep. yes, you can be amazing at whatever it is that you're doing, but how are you also giving back in other ways. When you're not making it about you, you're making it about them. That's making right. it about your community. Give back. Woo. Really good stuff. Feeling we empowered here. It.